Hi guys, Giving Gaming here with another awesome video. Now in this video, what the over? In this video, we will be talking about the freaking Elgato game capture device. I know a lot of my friends have been asking about different things, and I thought I may make a video just to tell you guys all about it because Christmas is coming, and you know every, it's hype, and everybody wants to get it because you know to this sort of Q and A of the Elgato. Before we start off this whole thing with, you know, Elgato Q&A and stuff, I'd like to tell you guys about what, how to set up your Elgato in the general. I won't have, like, a video thing going on because, well, I don't, I don't freaking have anything to tape it with, sort of sad, but you have your Elgato box, which is about the size of your hand or so. You're going to have a USB cord from your Elgato to your computer. You're going to have two HDMI cords from your Elgato to your Xbox and one from your Elgato to your uh, TV. Now once you've had this all set up, you're going to um, want to download a program off the Elgato site. And this program, you open it up, and it's it's just like this sort of recording program. You have like a play button in the down right corner and, you know, stuff. Now before this program starts working, you're gonna have, going to have to have your Xbox on or whatever system you're using. And then on the program, it'll start like recording and crap. And you may have to set up the different settings on your Xbox or PS3 or whatever you're using whatever you're using sort of match the Elgato because you can like record in certain you know like HD 1080 you know different things but there's just different settings so that's pretty much how it works so the Elgato device is what I use to you know capture all my gameplay and a lot of people from my clan have been asking and wondering you know how to use this questions about it random stuff so a uh, big question is what it can capture in general what systems it can capture and so it can get PS4, it can capture PS4, PS3, Xbox 360, Xbox One, and Wii U, and if you have an adapter of some sorts, it can actually capture iPod, so, or iPhone, whatever you want to use it for in that sort of phone, so. And Elgato's around $170 to $200, it sounds like a lot, but to be honest, this is probably one of the best and easiest ways to record your game gameplay, so, yeah. Another question was if an Elgato works with your laptop or anything, you know, laptop-y looking like what the frick. So, but yeah, it does work with your laptop. I recommend that you actually have sort of a setup with like a computer and, you know, a monitor and all that nice stuff. Just because it makes it a lot smoother to record and how I record, that's how I record. And that Another question that was asked by one of my friends, Specs, was is the editing software on the Elgato good or hard to use? And I'll be honest with you, the only thing that you can do with the Elgato editing software is uh, pretty much split up your clips and, you know, change it around. So, like, you split up your clips and then you can delete parts out of your clips. But honestly, the editing software on the Elgato is not where you want to use. It is crap. It does not do much. I wouldn't say it's hard to use because it's very simple. You know, you just have to get into the knowledge at what editing software really does for your videos but I recommend that you get Movie Maker because that's free and if you have a for Windows at least another question was if you had to have a computer at all times recording with your Elgato that is true there's a program on your computer like I said that sort of syncs up with your Elgato so you're gonna have to have a computer at all times hopefully that cleared up some of your questions and concerns about getting an Elgato and yeah give me gaming out see you guys later